gods and goddesses, what's it gonna be? Baron's Brew or Baba's Brew? You should grab a drink to call off from today's hot play. My name's Anuki, and this is Smite Top 5 Plays. Currently airborne is Rama. Awaiting them is Ymir, charging the shards of ice. Rama stays frosty and immediately ages, and so all is fine. They have to make their way through Ho Yi too. Yamoja brings the water to assist, and Agni brings the fire, making enemies desist. Ho Yi leaps away, but Agni tracks the tide with a rain of fire. They think it's all over. It is now. Thanato steals their soul. Triple freeze from Ymir. Susano no combos with Tsunami through them all, but it's the red wave that stands strong and confidently charge forth to end this bout. Ymir walls up, it doesn't save them, Poseidon Verena dropping the abyss, mass tentacle takedown! Tear survives and keeps fighting, Yemoja lives and cowers! Shoulders rubbing, red versus blue, red mage, blue warrior! Kabraken slamming in half for the fourth kill, Yemoja doesn't get away, but it's a long run and we've got other plays to see. Let the darkness go. Amaterasu isn't too happy about Bologna taking their blue buff. That's a reality they'll just have to accept. Loki announces themselves before stopping in, instead gets surprised by a waffle flagging stomp, switching from shield blocks to area bludgeoning. Supersonic Ink clubs Loki hard, unraveling the scourge for the first kill. Raijin and Capri add to Bologna's misfortune. Atlas rushing in with the way to the world. Stunned by Mandalay Discord makes picking up Capri and Amaterasu easy. Raijin singled out on Bob because of that cleanse. How about that? Supersonic putting on a belt of plus 10 strength. Leaving it a bit late, aren't we? Amaterasu and Capri trying to scrape together that last bit of damage. But the Scourge keeps them from teetering over the edge. Amaterasu defeated. Capri's got no chance. They won't even be able to bug out. That was close. This is what passes for a fight these days? Feel the weight of the world! The goddess of Venom, not who I would hire for a less standing defense, but here we are, and in they go! Blinking on top of the Nemesis for amazing slash damage damage, then jumping out, leaving everyone wounded! Wukong tanking the Phoenix whilst the others attack it. They won't get a chance. Second win for Ripes. Daggers confused. Nemesis dashing through Atlas. Crit jumping on Wukong. Who's the main target? They're all the target. Wukong slain. Atlas escaping. Nemesis flanking. But is greeted with an interrupting dagger. Whoa, Ripes. That was ripping. All too easy. Hades and Ymir giving chase, passing through the wall to catch Sobek, he's not off guard! Evades the frost breath, but not the silence, Apollo and Persephone join the fight, overwhelming the fractured enemy! Charybdis is hunted, eliminated before King Arthur was able to intervene! On the right, Sobek teams up with Daji. Maybe they can grab Apollo fleeing from King Arthur. They go do that. Hades doesn't succeed in stopping them, whilst Arthur extends their life through the use of their ultimate. Ymir answering back, you call that an ultimate? Ha <laughs> ha Boom! Daji looks down on everyone who will get pulled in. Hades is hooked. Circuit cleanses out and Persephone isn't hit. Daji jumps down away from the freeze and gets her toes crunched by Persephone. Sobex out of teammates, out of options. It started with them, it ends with them. They'll lurk in the waters with a full bar of health. Circuit of Persephone, both escape the splash. Now it's a river pile of RCV. 789 might be surrounded, but they still have five left and broke free with a tailwind, squeezing through the wall from the side. Reblank 25 with a dark, devastating slap. The age of Red Team is over. They are dismantled. My blood runs cold. Putting on my Sunday best. Red team hovering to the right, still to initiate with a blink sickle crush. It's ineffective. Poseidon and Anha are overly aggressive in their positioning. That will be Poseidon's demise. Sir Ken taking a ton of damage. The second monster ultimate misses. Anha's stuck behind their own pillar. Oh no! We're just left with Agni. The rest of the actors have left the building. Get rolling through the fire and the flame, stunning interrupt how you burn to cinders on the landing. This Agni is maxing out their cooldown. Another flame path and fuming stuff with humbats in this time. Temporal beats to draw out even more power. 
Flame wave on Gev. They absorb some of the burning with a shield. Zilla comes in from over the wall. Agni gets caught in the crouch. Gev blinks with a shock wave. That's when Agni ages. Running towards Zilla to drop her into fire. Not even going to look at that explosion because they want 80 Scorch Earth. Hot dash under the crush. Zilla keeps her distance with Sentinel. Hunbats takes the race, but Agni struggling to break out of the corner. Oh, are they? They capture Hunbats and make it fatal. Who's the real monster here? Progress is the stride of a god. I wanna see your plays. Check the video description for a link to submit your own featured plays earned gems and a top 5 plays avatar. If you were featured, contact me on discord.me forward slash toki or join us guys, gals and non-binary pals to chat, chill, group up and enter some of the giveaways. My name's Anuki and I hope to see you soon.